A local man entrusted to teach his young students karate is accused of preying on them instead. Good evening. I'm Steve Atkinson. And I'm Riel Creighton in for Kimberly Hunt. Police arrested 38 year old Juan Flores, a karate instructor outside the Z Ultimate Studio in Tierra Santa. The news reporter Candace Crone reports the charges involve lewd acts with minors. For the first time since being arrested last week, Juan Flores appeared in court to hear the shocking allegations against him. The karate instructor faces 15 counts of lewd act on a minor and oral copulation involving two of his male students, 14 and 17 at the time. Prosecutors say he used his studio in Tierra Santa to lure the victims. Touching, lying on the floor, massages, and then escalated to oral copulation of both of these victims. Prosecutors say he held sleepovers at the studio called Ninja Nights, where the kids would play video games and hang out. When you have parents that, you know, drop their kids off at places like a karate studio in the custody of somebody whom they believe will protect the kids, and instead they sexually abuse the kids. During the hearing, Flores' attorney asked the judge to lower his client's $320,000 bail to $100,000, citing he has no prior felony convictions and that over the years he's given back to the community. He has uh, contributed significantly to the community by providing self-defense courses to YMCA, battered women, Father Joe's uh, homeless center. Former student Stephen Lundberg was shocked when 10 News told him about the charges Flores faces, saying the karate instructor is someone he's always looked up to. In my whole life, he's just been there for me. He's kept me off the streets. He's been a fatherly figure in the sense that he's always been a role model. He's always been someone that I would strive to become. Police say there could be more victims. The judge increased Flores' bail from $320,000 to $350,000. He'll be back in court January 13th. Reporting in downtown tonight, Candace Crone, 10 News.